Hi everyone, and welcome to this episode of the CAS. I have a little makeshift backdrop set up here on my uh, dining room table. I just wanted to show off some things in more detail that I found in the unboxing of the wooden box that I recently did, specifically the keychains here that I had when I was younger. And I had three keychains, uh, three Star Trek keychains, this uh, Star Trek V, this Star Trek uh, 25th anniversary one, and this Star Trek original series Starship Enterprise one. And the thing about these is that they had matching pins, matching lapel pins too, which I got at Suncoast Pictures in the Granite Run Mall. So first one I'm going to do, I'm going to show off the Starship Enterprise keychain here. So there, it's, it's basically like a lapel pin, it's um, enamel with a smooth cover here. And I used this when I was in middle school and high school. I basically had just one or two keys on here. Um, the back is very reflective, as you can see. You can see my camera in there. But what it says, if you can read that, is... What the? Not very clear on camera, but it says copyright and... No, RNC 1989 PPC for Paramount Pictures Corporation and it was made in uh, Taiwan. So there you have this keychain with the original Enterprise on from the series, TV series, and it had a matching lapel pin. So this lapel pin is just like the it's just like the keychain. On the back it also says C and R. Now this says C and R for copyright and reserved 1985 PPC for Paramount Pictures Corporation in Taiwan and it the uh, it's a little off kilter there but anyway um yeah this was copyright had a copyright of 1985 whereas the keychain had a uh, copyright of 1989 that's probably what I got I probably got 1980, 1989 or 1990 okay, there's these two um, I'm gonna go over to the Star Trek 5 one Star Trek 5 is what got me into Star Trek I enjoyed it even though it's not one of the best ones I'll admit but um I, I still enjoyed it. it probably, I believe that it should have been a made-for-TV movie, considering the quality of the special effects that that was in the movie. But uh, there was a lot of restrictions that that William Shatner and the who directed it and the and Paramount had with this. So this says RNC probably reserved in copyright 1989 PPC. Um, so there's that with the Enterprise A there. Star Trek V, The Final Frontier, and here is the matching lapel pin. The thing about the lapel pin I noticed over the years is that the, there wasn't, especially in this area here, there's not a lot of uh, black enamel in, in the star of Star Trek, and even in the EK of Trek. But on the back it says it's copyrighted 1989 PPC in Taiwan. So there's those two. I always like those. But my favorite out of all these was this design. This is a very nice design. I like the I like the shade of the, the green, that greenish blue shade there. Almost aqua sort of shade there. But this was the, a one of the logos for the 1991. Uh, 25th anniversary for Star Trek. I have a bunch of other pins of Star Trek I'll show off sometime, but I'm showing off these right now. The back's basically the same as the other two, just uh, the brass. But look at that. that, that's a really nice, beautiful uh, enamel that they have in there. That, I like that shade. I always like that shade, that shade of greenish blue. But in another video, I'll show off my other Star Trek pins. I'll show off all of them. But here's the lapel pin, right there, and here's the back with the, the pin here. And this says, this also says copyright 1985. There you have it. That's about it. Not much to them. I just wanted to show, show off these, these pairs really quick. just want to thank you for coming to this episode of the CAS. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you later. Thanks. Bye.